Great pressure from Armstrong. He's looked very sharp. He looked sharp in pre-season. Looks sharp now that he's getting the game time too. He scored two very scrappy goals in the last couple of games. But as his dad, manager Allen said, it's instinct. That's why it's instinctive finishing from the centre forward. He's in the right areas, and that's the main thing. He's not our fox in the box, a la Francis Jeffers, is he, <laughs> in the early 2000s? I've got to give him credit, probably a, a little bit more of a rounded player than Francis Jeffers. <laughs> Blew it in by Patterson towards the back stick. Robbie Dale! Oh, and Luke Armstrong very nearly applied the finish in the six-yard area. Cross comes in from the right-hand side. Robbie Dale does ever so well to knock it back into the six-yard area. It's a good save by Ross Durant to keep out Luke Armstrong. Baker. Nathan Buttle prods it forward. Stephen Turnbull Good looks for a lovely early pass towards Matty Patterson. Patterson lets it bounce. It just skips away from him. He keeps it in on the left-hand side. Can he run it? Danny Gordon, lovely overstep. Flashes it across the box. Oh, oh Baker with a heavy oh. touch. And that could well be a penalty and nothing given. Patterson looks towards Armstrong. Couldn't quite get a touch on it, but... Charges down Goddard's attempt at clearance and Reed strides into the area. Sean Reed! Oh, it's clipped across the face of goal. Well wide in the end, but just opened up for Sean Reed after good work from Luke Armstrong. Perhaps they will pick out a pass on the left. Goddard spreads it across to Bather. Bather tries to pick a pass inside. It's blocked by Stephen Turnbull out to Coleman. Coleman with a ranger! Oh, Ooh, it's. Good save. Tip behind by Adam McHugh. Excellent stuff from the goalkeeper. And we did mention earlier that Rory Coleman can hit it. And that was a sweet strike from the left back. Robbie Dale now tries to play the ball into Sean Reed in the area. And Ilson clear it towards Nathan Buddle. Lovely little dummy by Nicholson. And Matty Patterson drives in from the left. Matty Patterson! Almost caught out. Ross Durant in the near post. It's a well struck effort from Patterson. Kept it low. And. Durant had to push it around his near post. It's played forward by Little down the left. Daniel Maguire's first touch on the left flank. He looks to come inside. He twists away. Lovely little 180 to get away from the defender. He plays it back towards Stephen Turnbull. Turnbull hops onto his other foot. Back to Daniel Maguire. Maguire stretching and does well, delivers it in. Robbie Dale at the back post and pushed away again by Ross Durant. Great delivery by Maguire and a good firm header from Robbie Dale. Either side of the goalkeeper, that one's in. Plays it inside for Stephen Turnbull. There's a little bit of space across to the left. Moving forward with real menace here. Michael Little, Robbie Dale. Dale gets past his man. Checks inside Lewis Rose. Rolls, Lewis Rolls again and he's oh, been penalty. pulled down. It's a penalty to Blythe Spartans. This time, Robbie Dale gets the decision in his favour. And it will be the captain, Robbie Dale. They've tried everything else to beat Ross Durant. Dale himself has come close on one or two occasions. Can the Blythe Spartans captain open the score in here at Croft Park? It's Robbie Dale. It's saved, and the rebound is tucked in by Matty Patterson. A great save, low to the left by Ross Durant. But Matty Patterson reacted very quickly indeed and stroked it past the goalkeeper. It looked for a moment as though Ross Durant was going to keep out the second effort. That's Matty Patterson's sixth goal of the campaign so far. And Blythe Spartans just about take the lead, and deservedly so. Looking at here, and again, Rory Coleman is, is further forward, much further forward than Bather. As Conor Walters on the other side knocks the ball out of play for a throw-in, but... He's definitely the left full-back, that Bather. He seems to be the full-back, but he's not playing like one. No, he doesn't have that defensive quality, and Robbie Dale just skips past two players. Dale into the box. He's round a third. Robbie Dale! What a fantastic goal that is by Robbie Dale. He went past one. He went past another. Sidesteps the centre half. Cool as you like. And then lashes the ball high into the roof of the net. Wonderful stuff by the Blythe Spartan skipper. 
And the goals are flying in now. Blythe Spartans 2, Ilsen 0. They just couldn't get anywhere near him for that goal. He drift, he just dr he just glides through challenges, turns them one way and the other. And, and what a what a a fantastic finish into the roof of the net. Looking down the left hand side, Dwyer escapes the attention of Wade and it opens up for Laval Moore. Oh, what a goal. Ilson have pulled one back. It's Blind Spartans two. Ilson one almost out of nothing there. Dwyer fed the ball in to Malachi Lavelle Moore and it opened up his body just outside the area, drills it low past the outstretched palm of Adam McHugh and that is disappointing for Blythe Spartans who were very much dominant for all of the game, not just the second half and now there's just one goal in it. You'd expect them to loft this long, wouldn't you? Just towards those attackers, Dexter Atkinson, Anthony Dwyer. And of course, the goal scorer, Malachi Lavelle Moore. They've got four up there now. They've got three waiting for the loose ball. Goalkeeper puts it into the box. Headed away by Robbie Dale. Comes to Atkinson. Oh! Almost contact oh. there at the back stick by Malachi Lavelle Moore, who very nearly got his second and Hilston's second of the evening. That would have been a real hammer blow for Blythe Spartans. That was about as close as you're going to get to scoring without scoring. It's that hassling and harrying style. It will draw your fair share of fouls. Take that out of his game. He's a completely different player, though. He's played towards the left-hand side. Robbie Dale now will oh, well run it. The defence, he feeds it to Luke Armstrong. Can Luke Armstrong clinch it? He can! Fantastic finish by Luke Armstrong. And Blythe Spartans surely now have clinched all three points. Excellent again by Robbie Dale striding down the left-hand side and opened up nicely for him and instead of going towards the corner flag he was brave enough to move towards goal he fed the ball into the path of Luke Armstrong and Luke Armstrong once he get into the, gets into those areas he doesn't miss super finish it's wasn't another it another wonderful finish it's rather similar to that against Sutton Coldfield earlier in the season when he just took a touch composed himself and then fires into the top corner so Yelston should walk off this pitch feeling a bit disappointed that they didn't adopt this attitude earlier in the game. Mm. So they, the last 15 minutes, they've, they've tested Blythe. That is the full-time whistle. Final score here at Croft Park. Blythe Spartans 3, Ilson 1.